Right, so this is the first day of my new life. Ah, parsnip seeds. He's received 30, 15 parsnip seeds. Here's a little something to get you started. Bear Lewis. Oh, that's nice of him. That's uh, isn't it nice? And oh, okay. That's fine. Right, I think what I'll do. I'll just have a look at the, on the telly. Living off the land. Welcome to living off the land. We're back again with another tip for you all. Now listen up, this one's for all your greenhorns out there. Chop wood and search for wild forage to earn some cash while waiting on your first harvest. Okay, I might do that. Right, let's go. Let's do just clear something. Get some more wood. this out a bit more right let's oh right I think we can now plant some more plant some parsnips Let's pile out the parsnips. And 
and those mixing water. And that's some more. So, uh, and let's make chest. That's it for now. Right, time to go to town. Yeah, that's that's a huge amount. the calendar, the Egg Festival, various birthdays, oh Lucy's birthday next, uh, Pierre's general store, closed on Wednesdays, okay, calendar again, Be Mike, the new farmer. I'm Caroline. Oh, hello, Caroline. My husband runs the general store here. And have you met my daughter, Abigail? She's the pale one with the purple hair. No, nope, I haven't met her yet. Pleased to meet you. Oh, who are you? Hello, it's nice to meet you. You picked a good time to move here. The spring is lovely. Oh, I'm oh, pleased to meet you as well. Hey, it's Mr. Mike, the new farmer. I'm Pierre, owner of the local general store. Oh, hello, Pierre. If you're looking for seeds, my shop is the place to go. I'll also buy produce from you for a good price. Oh, okay. A little agriculture can really inject new life in new, um, into the local economy. Oh. That's what you sell. Right, that's all getting a bit expensive. I think I'll leave it for now. Well, nice to meet you. And you too. <sighs> nice little town. If you lives in here? Oh. Um, it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, hey? Now, name's George, by the way. Now, buzz off. <sighs> Charming. Charming. Alright, oh, okay. <clears throat> right, 
He's here. Oh, hello, I'm Penny. Oh, nice to meet you, Penny. in here. Oh, hello there. Welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Ah, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display. But I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? Yes, will do. Right. Anyone else? Here? Yeah, it's definitely rather empty. up here oh it's locked hey okay. oh, what a nice little town So how was your first night in the old cottage? Oh, hmm, okay. Bed was a bit uncomfortable. Your grandpa used to complain about that rickety old bed. But I think deep down, he actually loved that house. Uh, <laughs> well, pleased to meet you again. Actually, no, I need to go up here. Oh, couple of people here. Aren't you the one who just moved in? Yes, that's me. I'm Maru. I'm, look I'm looking for forward to meeting you. Ah, well, my name's Mike. Pleased to meet you. You know, with a small town like this, a new face could really alter the community dynamic. It's exciting. So you're the new guy here. Huh? Cool. I'll see you around. Okay, yeah, I'll see you around too. Oh well. Doesn't want to speak to me. Farmer boy, aren't you? Yep, that's me. Oh, I'm Haley. Oh, yeah, uh, and uh, I'm Mike. Pleased to meet you. Hmm, if it weren't for those horrendous clothes, you might actually be cute. <laughs> ah. Uh, nice 
between you. Oh, stranger, my name's Vincent. Oh, nice to meet you. Mama said not to talk to sold strangers, but you seem okay. Uh. Uh. <laughs> oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined. But that's okay. I'm Jody. Oh, nice to meet you. It's a quiet little town, so it's very exciting when someone new moves in. Having a farmer around could really change things. Oh, hey. Okay. Oh, nice to meet you. Shall we go around here? Locks. Well, that adds that one. Right. Well, that's the uh, livestock. Right. I think it's time to go to the bar. Yes, I think I'll have some. I think I'll have a beer. Thank you. Right, so. Yes, let's drink that beer. Right. Kid, the name's Pam. Oh, nice to meet you, Pam. My name's Mike. Nothing like a sip of the old good stuff to warm those old bones. Yep, that's true. Well, hello there. I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Star Drop Saloon. Oh, nice to meet you. My name's Mike, by the way. You need... Uh, well... No, not now. That was a nice, nice, lovely beer. Ooh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Oh, will do. Clint. Oh, hi Clint. My name's Mike. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. Okay, I'll keep that in mind. I don't know you. Why are you talking to me? Well, I'd just like to meet all the people around town. Why not? Oh! Ah, settling in. Let's play that.
uh, the game's room. Oh, wow, I can actually... Cool, like, um... <laughs> oh, no! <laughs> um... <laughs> what do I do? <laughs> no! Um, uh, am I... Right, so I'm supposed to shoot. Ah, right. Let's see how I can do this. Oh no, no, no! Game over. Um, I think I'll quit that. So, um, ow. that's all. Well, I think it's time for me to go now. Uh, good evening. Have, have a uh, see you next time. Right, time to go home. Time to go to bed. A quick look at the chest. Anything I need to? Do I can make anything else? Torch. Nothing really exciting at the moment. What I might do, I might, uh, might do. Okay, I think I'll leave it for now. Right. Good night all. Well, that was a really interesting first new day of my new life. I think I'll go to bed now. Good night. <laughs>